Hi everyone, Lindsay. Here's a hockey question from the Close Call Sports Discord server. Invite link is in the description. You have your own questions. You can go to Discord and ask them and you might get them on the channel. So, Pittsburgh, Arizona, hockey. Arizona is on a power play, five on four, but they commit a penalty, so it's a delayed penalty. Pittsburgh pulls the goalie, out comes the extra skater, and the strategy for the Penguins is to waste time, try to kill the initial penalty. Except it doesn't work. For the Penguins, they're, they're just trying to kill as much time off. It went in! Oh my goodness! Yeah, that's an own goal. So the question is, Arizona was technically on a power play, right? So why doesn't this goal cause the initial Pittsburgh penalty? I mean, you have a power play goal. So shouldn't the opposing player come out of the box? That the penalty then expires. Shouldn't play resume then with, with Pittsburgh on the power play for the Keeping second penalty, which was the Arizona puck. penalty. Trying to let that penalty kill Let's go to the rule book. It turns out that when a goal is scored, when the teams are at an even numerical strength regarding skaters, not goalies, that there is no termination of an existing minor penalty if the team that is scored upon is the otherwise quote-unquote shorthanded team because they have pulled their goalie voluntarily. They pulled the goalkeeper for an extra attacker. That created a numerical equality in terms of skaters. So when that goal is scored, it's not technically scored with a man advantage for the skaters for Arizona. So in this case, what we have is we have effectively a five on five situation, even though, you know, one of the teams has a goalie and one doesn't, it's still a five on five skater situation. So when that goal gets scored, it's considered no numerical advantage for either team, nothing with the penalties changes. The Arizona player goes to the box because he committed a penalty. That's the new penalty. But the Pittsburgh player in the box doesn't leave because it wasn't a numerical advantage goal. It was a numerical equality or even strength goal, even though it was technically a power play. I hope that makes some sense. But this was a funny little play that you asked about. And I did want to talk about it because I do know a bit about hockey. Thanks for the question. Visit us online at closecallsports.com. Join our Discord server, as mentioned earlier. Like and subscribe, and we'll see you on the site.